I'd be a hell of a lot. Your claim didn't insist on using those crazy pimps as his guard dogs. Yeah. Like animals. Nah. The control. These things, though. I don't know what they are. Who do you think you see? That poor bastard? Yeah. <laughs> Out, I imagine. Damn. I was thinking I could give one to my daughter. You're not worried about the what's it called? The residue? Of what? Oh, whatever chemical that guy got a dose of. Nah, that stuff was in plastic. I'm sure it's fine. Besides, she's got a thing for rabbits, my daughter. How old is she? He's sick. Watch yourself. That thing shocked me a few hours back. No kidding. You're lucky it didn't fry you crispy. Sure as hell has enough juice to. Right. I'm luck all over. Sure. A little shock therapy probably did you good. Hurry up and get it fixed. I don't like being out in the open like this. I don't want to be here when that thing shows up. That whatever. Demon. He ain't a demon. It's a guy in a mask. Just get the skylight fixed and let's get out of here. The doctor said this skylight is... so jumpy. You don't really believe in the Batman, do you? Nah. All I know is Crane's scared. Whatever scares him sure as hell scares me. What do you mean? The doc seems like the usual creepy neurotic. Look how many of us he's got here. Just watching the place, waiting for something bad to happen. Something big's going down and something bad's on the way. Guaranteed. Campbell go. What? Campbell's gone. Jason! Jason, you there? Oh, crap. This is trouble. Calm down, man. You're making me nervous. 
is a very private man. He doesn't like his uh, research meddled with. I don't know anything, I swear. So what were you doing in the basement? I was... I was just lost. Sure you were. You weren't nosing around any canisters or nothing. No! No, I don't know anything about the toxin. It, it's just... I didn't say anything about a toxin. Please, I just want to go home. Your home's a cell now, Dr. Thomas. A red jumpsuit and a world of hell. You don't have to worry too much. You'll have a lot of company by dawn. All right, enough of this. Let's throw her in brain surgery and ask Crane what he wants. No, stay back! You shouldn't be here, Dr. Thomas. And you especially shouldn't have been poking around down below. I didn't see anything. Please, just let me go. It's out of our hands, sweetheart. There are natural laws about what happens to curious kittens, isn't there? Alfred, find out what you can on a Dr. Emma Thomas. She has information on Crane. Right away, sir. And I'll need you to locate the brain surgery theater on my radar. That's where they're keeping her. Done, sir. 